diffuser? Right there, yeah. He's gonna need to take down some of that grass in. Oh, uh, we can shoot through it, it's good. So we're set up to do long range precision fires training. We're using the M40A5 and the M110 SAS, which are the 7.62 millimeter uh, sniper rifles organic to the Marine Corps. Uh, basically, we're just training unknown distance qualifications for the Marines. So they've got all their gear on and they're practicing engaging targets from 200 to 800 meters. Doro. What this training focuses on is our ability to shoot long range. Uh, the teams are working in pairs, so we're working in the shooter-observer dialogue. Uh, we're also working in tight spaces. We're in different positions, simulated hide sites, uh, just to improve our overall operability uh, in different terrain. A little bit later, we'll be getting into the M107 Sasser which is the 50 caliber variant that we have. Uh, we'll be engaging targets out, uh, again, to about 1,000 meters with that, training the long-range precision marksmanship capability of the Marines. So, uh, this particular training area gives us a really unique opportunity, being three times the size of 29 Palms. Gives us uh, incredible flexibility with what we're able to do out here that uh, we really are, are only limited to doing at 29 Palms back in the States. Uh, the ranges allow for a dynamic that we can't find in the states. Uh, we have obstacles in the way when we're doing different ranges, which uh, adds to a more realistic dynamic that we don't get on Pendleton. This is vital. Uh, it's key. These, these Marines are seeing how we, how we conduct business as a platoon, and they're going to learn, learn the right way and the wrong ways uh, to facilitate training for the future Marines of the platoon. <sighs> That's how you call win, Doc.